picking up the win today, getting the series win post All Star break? Oh, big time. You know, answering back, especially after the two games in Houston and then getting a chance to, you know, bounce back after a tough loss last night. Uh, that's that's going to be big going to this off day and kind of heading back to New York. 37 home runs now this season. We're not even through July. Is that a big number to you? Uh, I'm trying not to think about it, like I said before. Um, just happy to. You know, DJ got us going with that big double and, you know, just trying to follow suit with him, man. He's been swinging the bat well, hitting it right at guys, hitting it 120, I feel like, every single time. So he's he's locked in. I'm just trying to follow his lead. And a lot of sluggers that have a lot of home runs don't hit for high average. And I asked Aaron Boone that, and he said how it's so important for you to, to hit for an average, too. Is it? Is that, can you talk about that a little bit? Yeah, like I've always said, for me, a good hitter is, you know, a guy with, a, you know, a high average. That's, you know, what I saw as a kid, and that's what I saw a lot of the greats. You know, Albert Pujols, Miguel Cabrera, man, they always hit above 300, 330, and, you know, the power just kind of came with it. So, um, you know, that's always a goal of mine is try to hit above 300, and um, we'll, keep, we'll keep working towards it. Boone said you weren't happy with your first at-bat, and you turned to him and said, I'm going to get him this time. Is that exactly what you had in mind? Yeah, just uh, – Took some pitches I shouldn't have, just a poor, you know, especially at the top of the lineup. I got to get things going. You know, DJ leads off, drills the ball to right center, it gets caught. You know, I got to follow him up and do something too. Um, you know, just had a bad approach up there and just kind of told him, I said, I, I won't let you down this time. So, what, what adjustments did you make? Uh, just locking it in more, you know, uh, especially we had a guy in scoring position. It's, you know, I got I to gotta drive him in, you know. Um, no real big change, just locking on your approach and have some fun. Over the years, what have you liked about the Subway Series? Uh, just the fans getting into it. It's always a packed playoff atmosphere, um, always back and forth. You never know what's going to happen. Um, and just a competition. You know, they got a great pitching staff, great offense over there. You know, so do we. So, you know, looking forward to see what happens. You think it's going to be a little different this year? Because of how well you guys are playing and the Mets are playing. Well, it's always good for the city when both you know New York teams are you know doing their thing. You know, so um, no, this is going to be a fun one. Like I said, you know they got a great team over there, and you know looking forward to you know battling out the next few days. Did your dad have any further thoughts on hitting it to left field here? Uh, no, no pep talk from him. He just said keep doing your thing. <laughs>